Yeah, today we decided to show you the full screen to give you some more details about our um, interesting stocks or trades of the last day. There's like um, two um, interesting trades where we realized in a short term already some uh, some profit like Snapchat here, for example. Snapchat uh, will publish the um, um, earnings today after the market closed. So if you see this video, the earnings will be already reported. But the idea here the behind this trade was pretty simple. If we um, go a little bit back in our chart, we can see here, um, for example, this was like um, the um, the resistance line where we had a breakout on um, Monday, um, oh sorry, on Tuesday almost, um, and then yesterday the real breakout started. But the idea was we we see the earnings are coming, market um, um, is positive, um, Snapchat was performing um, in the direction of a new all-time high, and so the idea behind the trade, I think we had this um, already earlier with some some other trades like Apple or Wells Fargo. If you check one of our earlier videos uh, here on YouTube, that this um, stock will um, move in the same direction till earnings will announce because after the earnings uh, it's always um, difficult or before earnings we don't know what exactly will happen that's a little bit um, like gambling i would say but if you have a good trend the market is going the same direction and uh, maybe there's a, a breakout after uh, above a resistance the probability is quite high that uh, you um, the stock will move uh, one or two days in this direction and you can gain some profits if this is like here um, on the left hand side with the option where we um, 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 gained like 20 30 percent or if it's with the stock where you can also easily um, make a few dollars in um, this two three days um, and before the earnings will announce uh, will, uh, will be announced normally we um, I would recommend to close the position, especially if you see a position like Snapchat, because um, you just have to have a look at the last earnings, uh, what we had here at the end of October. There was a huge gap. And um, of course, if you have a long position, you will be happy with this uh, movement. But if you're invested in the other direction, it's um, yeah, it will be painful, um, especially if you're directed invested in this um, in this stock. So um, that's something you can always check in the chart history or you will see it um, also in some other informations um, where you need to double check um, if there's any big gap or how the movements look after the last earnings. Yeah, this was the first thing. And the second thing was DraftKings Incorporation here. The idea was that we already had a breakout above the last um, um, local highs, I mean the all-time high or the 52-week high is still um, here at $64. But um, as we can see, and we can also have here a look in the pre-market settings, uh, then you will see it maybe a little bit um, a little bit clearer. Give me a second, I will just change the sessions. And then you can see already um, since yeah the pre-market started a little bit later, we have a quite significant um, up move where we might even see a new 52-week high or all-time high. I don't know if it's an all-time high. We can double check this um, um, today. So uh, same, if we upload the video, we might already see this um, um, new all-time high here, um, but it's... Um, yeah, it's the same same idea or similar idea with Snapchat. The breakout um, started, um, I think, yeah, yesterday, and uh, we had also quite a good um, option volume, as we can see here. Um, so that's are the main key facts um, why we decided to open a position here. Just let it, let's have a look. Yeah, it's also an all-time high, or it will be an all-time high. Um, and uh, might be interesting um, if the breakout will really happen or um, if it will just have a normal double high and move back um, for short correction. Um, these are the scenarios, um, but um, 
what is um, always a very high probability that at least there will be a testing for this um, highest um, price or the all-time high. So um, with small, I would say, swing trades are possible in this period of time. Yeah, these are the first things. And the second, um, or some other symbols, what we are having is um, connected to the um, healthcare industry as well as the um, uh, cannabis production or cannabis industry. Um, what we can see here is the symbol SNDL. Um, and now big pharma companies, uh, they, they are interesting on the effects of, um, um, in the medical um, sense of uh, wheat or cannabis. And there are some really big deal signs, for example, here, um, just a symbol from yesterday, organic gram holdings uh, with the symbol OGI. Um, there was a seven, seven billion um, deal signed with a pharma company, and we saw here really um, um, a high option volume also on a short term, like for example, here till the middle of February, so just for a few days, that this stock will double. You can um, see it on the left hand side as a call option on a uh, um, strike price $5, um, and this is still even now means. Um, 100% um, um, this stock needs to move 100% that this price um, will be reached. And I think um, these are very interesting um, stocks for small size um, accounts. Even option trading is interesting because you have a um, quite good implied volatility if you might, or if you want to buy this um, stocks cheaper or if you just, just want to invest in the stock directly. So the both symbols here, OGI, and the second one is SNDL. Both companies from Canada um, still um, considered as, um, yeah, let's say, healthcare or pharma or truck industry. Um, but as we mentioned it earlier in our videos, you can always double check all this information on finvis.com. Um, and yeah, I would be happy if you don't want to miss any of our next videos, if you also subscribe here to our YouTube channel. Um, so yeah, take care and hope to see you soon in um, our next videos.